Bonjour and bienvenue to another Paris Top Tips video. If you've been following my channel for a while, you're well aware that Saint-Germain-des-Prés holds a special place in my heart as one of the most beloved neighborhoods in the City of Light. You might also have noticed that, being a true Frenchman at heart, food holds a significant and delightful role in my life. As the saying goes in France, the English eat to live, while the French live to eat. As I love sharing my preferred food spots, come join me on a personally curated journey through some of the best food and drink providers in Saint-Germain-des-Prés. Our journey kicks off at the former Saint-Germain Covered Market, a historic gem from the 19th century that underwent a complete transformation in the 90s, revealing a new life and vibrancy. In this revamped building, the renowned French supermarket brand Monoprix has introduced Epic, a premium grocery haven. This innovative concept merges a grocery store, fresh and catering departments, featuring charcuterie and cheese, a wine merchant and a greengrocer, all within a spacious 500 square meter retail space. If you're staying at a hotel or Airbnb in the vicinity, make this your supermarket of choice for an array of excellent and premium goods. If you're not a fan of supermarkets and lean more towards authentic markets, simply exit EPIC through the back alley and you'll find yourself right in the Saint-Germain covered market. Among all the merchants there, two stand out as easily the best in their respective categories in the neighborhood. Cheese enthusiasts rejoice! Fromager Sanders is hailed as one of the premier cheese shops in Paris. It's an excellent spot to grab some cheese for a delightful picnic at the nearby Jardin du Luxembourg. For those opting to stay in an apartment and cook rather than dine out, unquestionably Boucherie Saint-Germain is the best butcher shop in Saint-Germain-des-Prés. Our next destination, Arnaud Larère, pâtissier and recipient of the prestigious Meilleur Ouvrier de France Award in 2007, is just a stone's throw away. He excels not only in crafting exquisite pastries, but also in the art of French chocolate. He has been consistently voted among the top 15 chocolatiers in France since 2013. That's the man. Once again, a brief walk takes us to our next stop. While this tour primarily focuses on French food, I'm making a delightful exception, this time, for some exceptional Spanish fare. Viandas de Salamanca is a petite yet essential shop, a must visit for any Iberian ham enthusiast.
A slightly longer stroll along Boulevard Saint-Germain brings us to the iconic crossroads where we find the celebrated trio of Café des Deux Magots, Café de Flore and Brasserie Lip nestled together in a pocket-sized haven. Richard stands as one of the neighborhood's premier chocolatiers. However, what truly captivates me is their mastery in crafting macarons. Regrettably, when I created videos on the finest macarons in Paris, I was yet to discover them. Oh, what a mistake that was. Richard unquestionably delivers some of the absolute best macarons in Paris. However, if your preference leans towards chocolate, rest assured as they excel in crafting some of the finest chocolates in the vicinity. Especially in the lead up to the Christmas holiday season, don't miss their heavenly marron glacé or candied chestnuts, truly to die for. Another French delicacy frequently enjoyed during the Christmas season, the delightful chocolate truffle. And last but not least, indulge in the delightful pâte de fruits or fruit jelly. If you have a sweet tooth, a visit to Richard is an absolute must. Our next gastronomic destination is just a short stroll away, just near the beautiful Place Furstenberg. When in front of 12 Rue Jacob, step through the porch, and in a lovely tree-lined courtyard, discover Tomats, an adorable grocery store, the last one after the Japanese knife maker. Tomats is the ideal spot to discover superb French gastronomic gifts for your loved ones or to savor for yourself. Feel free to seek advice from the shop owner. She will gladly guide you and ensure you sample the products to help you make the best choice. With all these delectable products surely whetting your appetite, just a mere 100 meters ahead, make a pit stop at Cozy, known for serving the best sandwiches in the area. Anticipate a bit of weight though, it's worth it. In this Italian sandwich shop, whether you opt for a salad or a sandwich, rest assured you'll be treated to fresh and flavorful ingredients, complemented by excellent sauces. I took a tomdouli with tandoori turkey ham, cheddar and roasted tomatoes. Really excellent, the turkey ham is to die for. If you lean towards French sandwiches rather than Italian ones, just another 100 meters away, you'll find yourself at Cul de Cochon, located on Rue de Bussy. And if your French vocabulary happens to be limited to the basics, it's worth noting that Cul de Cochon translates to pig's ass. So, whatever part of pig picks your interest, you're bound to find it in this quaint boutique. Obviously, the cheese doesn't come from the pig. However, they do boast an array of excellent cheeses, some of which are also featured in the sandwiches they offer. For wine enthusiasts, Pepite is a mere 20 meters away, offering a delightful selection. Mm. 
with an outstanding selection and a wide variety, paired with impeccable service, Pepit unquestionably stands as the premier wine merchant in Saint-Germain. In the cellar, they've created a lovely space where you can enjoy cheese and deli delights while sipping on a glass of fine wine. Craving some ice cream? Just a two-minute walk away and we'll find ourselves at Grom, the globally renowned Italian ice cream maker. You can't see them, but trust me, they are very good. Embarking on the longest leg of our food tour, spanning almost 500 meters. Along the way, indulge yourself by taking a detour through the Cours du Commerce Saint-André. It's truly magnificent. While on Rue des Grands Augustins, be sure to visit Mariage Frère, the esteemed tea company. Founded in 1854, Mariage Frère is a luxurious tea house, widely regarded as the most prestigious tea house in the world. Its tea menu features an extensive selection of over 650 blends, sourced from 36 tea producing countries, covering a very diverse range of tea varieties. Their bestseller tea is called Marco Polo, and I must have a very common taste, as it's also a tea I love. It's not until the 13th stop on our food tour that we encounter a bakery, but that's because Boulangerie Liberté is situated near the Saint-Germain neighborhood limits, not far from the Latin Quarter. This very local boulangerie, quite popular with the locals, offers an amazing array of freshly baked breads, cookies, pastries, cakes and croissants. You absolutely need to try one of their pain au chocolat. Or maybe their chausson aux pommes. Or the babka. There's so much to choose from. The final stretch of our culinary journey brings us back to Boulevard Saint-Germain, to yet another Meilleur Ouvrier de France shop. Primarily known as a chocolatier, Georges Larnicole has won my heart with his quignette. These are the famous quignette. They are in fact small quignaman, a sweet Brittany cake made with laminated dough containing layers of butter and incorporated sugar. While the macarons here are good, my preference leans towards those of Richard, as we've already discovered. Naturally, chocolates crafted by a Meilleur Ouvrier de France are undeniably excellent. However, as I'm not particularly fond of chocolates, they are not my top choice. I must 
that make these Christmas decorations in chocolate are absolutely cute. There's a saying in France that goes, five minutes in the mouth, five years on the hips. Anyway, I don't care. I love these queen yet too much. And that concludes our journey. As is customary with my video strolls, you'll find a link to a downloadable map in the description below. I hope you enjoyed this video, but above all, I hope it proves to be useful for you. Subscribing to my channel would demonstrate to me that the content I create for you is appreciated.